The draft encryption policy released by the Department of Electronics and Information Technology has been withdrawn, but we still think you should know all about encryption. What is encryption? In an encryption scheme, the intended communication information or message referred to as plain text is encrypted using an encryption key generated by an algorithm which in turn generates a cipher text that can only be read if decrypted. All messaging services like WhatsApp, Viber, Google Chat, Yahoo Messenger use encrypted services. This encryption happens automatically using keys at both ends of the conversation and users don't play a role in this. Banks and e-commerce sites also use encryption to protect financial and private data including passwords. An authorized recipient can easily decrypt the message with the key, but unauthorized interceptors can't. How did encryption originate? The preamble to the draft policy states that encryption technology was traditionally deployed most widely to protect the confidentiality of military and diplomatic communication. However, the revolution in internet technology expanded the scope of encryption to e-commerce and e-governance civilian applications. What was the draft policy? According to the terms of the new draft encryption policy, user shall reproduce the same plain text and encrypted text pairs using the software or hardware used to produce the encrypted text from the given plain text. All information shall be stored by the concerned business or citizen entity for 90 days from the date of transaction and made available to law enforcement agencies as and when demanded in line with the provisions of the law of the country. This means that users would need to keep a record till 90 days of messages shared on social media and messaging services since these are encrypted. What were the concerns raised? The biggest concern of this new policy is around the fact that users and organizations would on demand need to store all communication in plain text for 90 days from the date of transaction and make it available to law enforcement agencies in line with the provisions of the laws of the country. Other concerns are around the government prescribing the algorithms and key sizes for encryption, implying government control over all data. And how will users be able to figure out if their messages are encrypted or not? How will they be able to store the plain text version of the encrypted communication for 90 days and keep it away from potential hackers? Let us wait and watch for the revised draft.